Okay, in this video, I'll be cleaning some problematic windows. These are all second floor windows. These ones don't open, so it's like a big fixed window. I've already cleaned the inside and you can't really see the dirt until it focuses. There we go. So you can see it is pretty dirty on the outside. We just had some gale force winds ripping through here. You can see it's blown some grass and crap against the window as well. So I gotta get that off, but I only really have two options. One is to use a ladder and the second one is to use this. So I went to Home Depot and I got a really long telescopic pole for second floor windows. I got a microfiber chamois scrubbing cloth and I got a squeegee head and I wish the squeegee was a little bit bigger and it's like maybe a 12 inch or perhaps a 16 would have been a better size. For the cleaning solution, it's two liters of water in there and then for each liter they say to use two capfuls. So that bottle will last me I guess until I die. That's how long that bottle will probably last for. And to hold the solution, I'm just using a Tupperware container. Now for this first window, I don't actually have to use this squeegee and pole combination. I could just use cloths and a spray, but just so you can see a little bit of a close up, pretty simple. Get the microfiber wet, rub it on the window for a while, and then come over with the squeegee. And really the only trick here is to make sure that you don't get water behind the squeegee or the cleaning solution. And then just have a cloth so you wipe the squeegee off after each pass. And then make sure that you're overlapping so that again, you don't have wet streaks in the middle of the window. Overall pretty easy. And like I said, just make sure that the squeegee gets wiped between passes you don't necessarily have to go top to bottom like this. I'm sure there's other ones. If you're using a smaller window, you can go sort of across the top and down and that'll keep the cleaning solution flowing sort of downward. However, when you start dealing with the second floor windows and you're at the bottom, you can't necessarily do that. And then one other thing is just take the cloth. In my case, I'm just using paper towel and clean up all the solution that's on the window frame and clean the window frame at the same time. Now, the real reason I got all this equipment is actually mainly for that large center window that doesn't open. So now it will extend this thing. I would say this telescopic pole would be good for second floor windows only, and you're just not gonna reach a third floor window with this pole. If you wanna do a third floor, you're gonna need a ladder or something else. I suppose if you're standing on a deck, perhaps it'll work. You'll notice my deck has no railings, so that will probably be a future video. Basically every square inch of this house is going to be a future video. So same deal as the other window. Take the microfiber, scrub the window down uh, after it's been sitting in the solution for a bit. And if you need to clean the microfiber cloth, you can throw it in the washing machine apparently. Although I didn't really clean enough windows to have to do that. This window is definitely a little tougher with the squeegee, but still very doable. It's definitely hard to keep it in one smooth pass. And I found that if you sort of stop in the middle of the window, it kind of leaves a wet mark behind. I also edited it out a little bit. I didn't start in the middle. I started on the far left side, but you get the idea. Just keep going down the window, getting all the cleaning solution off. And I found it looks pretty good when you're done. The other recommendation I would have is do your high windows first because it does spray water and cleaning solution kind of everywhere. Now for the sliding portion of the window, there is a screen in there, so you can't necessarily get that with the squeegee from the bottom. So these sliders actually can move out of the way and then just reach through and give the window a wipe down, obviously being careful not to fall out the window. You won't die from a second floor fall, but you will wish you were dead for a few minutes. Then spray down the other side that you have swung out of the way. And different windows have different mechanisms for swinging out of the way, but I do believe that most modern windows will do that. Put the screen back in, give the frame a little bit of wipe down because obviously it gets dusty and dirty on the outside. So the only other one I got here is a double hung window. So these work just like the sliders. There's two latches on the top and it allows the window to swing down because this has a full size screen and give that one a wipe down. And then this is called a double hung window. So the top piece will do the exact same thing. So if you had a single hung window, just the bottom piece would be able to do that. And because this is double hung, 
the top can uh, drop down and then it has the two clips on the top so you can swing it. And obviously it makes it very convenient for cleaning the windows and it just goes back up, moves back in place and then this one goes back up. The clips automatically go into place and that's pretty much it. Again, clean the frame and you're done. Anyway, thanks for checking out my video. Don't forget to like and subscribe.